Oh, okay. <laughs> Hey honeys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be all types of little stocking stuffers and gift ideas that I got from the Dollar Tree for this Christmas. So without further ado, let's just get into it. So for those who don't know, I absolutely love the Dollar Tree. I have like this unhealthy obsession with it. I am just a Dollar Tree like freak. I go there so much. It's kind of crazy, but I just love it so much. And so what better place to get little odds and end stocking stuffers and to come up with cute little gift ideas. I mean, they have so much stuff there and it's really not hard to come up with little extra gifts for the holiday season. So I am going to be showing you guys things that I got as stocking stuffers, things that I am making into full gift ideas, and also I am actually going to be making my boyfriend Chandler an advent calendar this year, and so I am going to show you guys things that I got for his advent calendar, um, but the things that I got for the advent calendar could easily just be used as stocking stuffers. I mean, these are things that I would have put in his stocking this year, but instead I'm just doing like the whole advent calendar because I thought that that would be something fun to do. But yeah, when you hear me say something like the, for the advent calendar, just to know that that would also be a good stocking stuffer. So let's get into showing you guys what I got because I'm super excited. So first things first is wrapping paper. Now I know that this is not a gift, but this does of course go along with Christmas. And honestly, if you guys, you probably already know this, but if you are not getting your gift wrapping stuff or like bags, cards, all of that at the Dollar Tree, then you're doing it wrong, sis, because this is the best place to get it. And I know that you're probably not gonna be able to wrap too many gifts with each roll, but honestly, it's, a dollar and it's so cute I'm doing like a whole blue and silver and white theme this year so these are all the wrapping papers I got so far I know I'm probably gonna need to get more but I wanted to get them now so that I had them ready to go because I am almost on my Christmas shopping so I'm gonna be filming a gift guide video for you guys and then I'm wrapping everything and putting it under the tray <laughs> then to go along with the gift wrap I actually got these two things of ribbon these are just like blue sparkly ribbon I think that these are so cute and with the plain silver foil wrapping I'm gonna wrap these around the gifts and do like little bows and stuff so I thought that these were really cute of course from the Dollar Tree and now into the actual stuff oh wait actually I also got a spatula this is for me um because I needed a new spatula so there you go <laughs> so I got a pair of fuzzy socks I think fuzzy socks are so fun and I really just I love fuzzy socks I wear them all the time like in the winter time when it's cold under like people laugh at me but I wear them under like my Birk, like my Birkenstocks. Um, I love fuzzy socks and this is actually going to be part of a gift for someone else that I'm doing um, a like whole spa type gift so I got these fuzzy socks to go along with that and I think that these are just absolutely adorable and they're so soft and anywhere else fuzzy socks are so expensive so a dollar I mean you can't beat it. So these next few things are actually all going to be part of a gift as well. I'm just doing like a whole little girly, cute little like, not decor, but just like little girly stuff gift for someone. Um, and so I have this Vaseline um, Rosy Lips Lip Therapy. This is like a chapstick. This is my favorite chapstick. I love this stuff so much. It's so soft and it doesn't leave like a weird taste in your mouth like I've noticed some chapsticks do. I really, really enjoy this. Um, I also got a 2020 calendar. I thought this was super cute and I love just like the little floral um, design on it and then it's just pink on the back and it just is a regular calendar for 2020. Um, I also got this little pack of notebooks. So there's four notebooks in here, all different, and they kind of just match like that girly floral theme. And then also these little pens. These are just ballpoint pens, and there's like three different designs in there, as you can see, hopefully. And I thought that this was really cute as well. So these could very easily all be stocking stuffers, but like I said, I'm putting these together as part of a little gift that I'm doing for someone. Um, and just like other things going along with this, but I love these and I think that these are perfect for building up a gift or for a stocking stuffers. The next thing that I got is this little desk trash can. I think that this is so adorable. I don't, oh wait, it's not a trash can, it's a pencil holder. Oh, I mean, it's obviously looks like a trash can, but I thought this was like an actual 
little mini desk trash can. I think that this is so cute and I'm still undecided if I'm going to keep this for myself or if I'm going to put it with that gift that I just showed you guys. But I love this and either way this could easily go into a little gift like the one I just showed you that I'm building up into a full gift or it can be a simple little stocking stuffer. It's really, really cute. It's it's just different and I really enjoy it. So I thought that this was adorable and I knew I had to pick it up. The next thing that I got are these Mickey stickers. Now, anything Disney is always going to be pricey elsewhere. Unless you're at a place like the Dollar Tree where you know everything's gonna be a dollar. If you were to get these somewhere else, you can guarantee that these were going to be more than a dollar. So it comes with all these different stickers. There's like little, um, what are they called? Just like puffy stickers. And then there's um, all of these. Like these ones have like glitter on them. And then there's the foil stickers and the glossy stickers. So this comes with all kinds of stickers. There's over 150 in here. This is a really cute stocking stuffer for a kid in your life or even a teacher, honestly. If you're doing stocking stuffers for someone in your family, that's a teacher stickers are always really cute for teachers so I I just love this I think this is so so precious and these are actually for me but shh, I'm keeping these so the next thing um, is actually for dogs um, I love building up my dog's gifts from the Dollar Tree I think it's really fun and he's in the other room so don't worry he won't hear me but this bag has actually been in my room and he keeps sniffing it out and I'm like you gotta get away from it you still have more than a month left before Christmas um so I got him some new doggy shampoo and I also got these little dog biscuits that have like peanut butter um these just remind me like I've just been calling them like doggy nutter butters I love nutter butters so I think my little Cody will love those as well. And then I also got him some training pads. And no, he's not a puppy. I got these because he's the other end of the spectrum. He's very old. He's like 15 years old. And his little bladder is having a hard time maintaining itself nowadays. So I'm hoping maybe if I put down these little training pads, he'll have some less accidents. We'll see. <laughs> All right, so the next two things I'm going to show you guys are also part of like a full gift that I'm making. Um, so what I got here is this little towel. These are like little kitchen towels. They say, here comes Santa Claus. I think this is super cute. Um, this is just like one of those like little kitchen towels you like throw over your oven handle. And then also I got these little pot holders. They're the same design. They just say, here comes Santa Claus, with that same photo on there. And then also in oven mitt um, that says, here comes Santa Claus as well. And then to go along with that, I got these little, um, this cookie mix. It's Betty Crocker. These are just like peanut butter cookie mix. Um, and what I'm going to do with this is put these all together i'm not exactly sure like how i want it to look yet but i'm essentially i'm just going to like have these together and then put the little cookies up top and then tie this with some type of like bow um this is going to be part of my boyfriend's mom's gift um i don't think anything else we're getting her is going to like necessarily relate to this so this is just going to be like one of her gifts but i thought that this was a really cute gift all together it costs less than five dollars for all this stuff and it just looks really cute you know she's like she's a mom she is cooking and she enjoys like little christmasy stuff like this so i thought that this was a really cute gift and I don't know. I think it's like these little things that you can build up to make into super adorable, like extra gifts for people. So the next few things I'm going to show you guys are all little stocking stuffers for my boyfriend's nephews. I thought that these were all super cute and honestly, I love Disney if you couldn't already tell by most of the other videos on my channel. But um, I know that they do as well. So I was really excited when I saw all of these Disney things. So I got them each one of these. So these are little activity fun sets. They have two pencils in here. Um, I believe that's a sharpener. Yeah, a sharpener, an eraser, and then like a little um, notepad. Um, so this is so cute. These are adorable. Like I said, if you were to get these anywhere else, they, these would at least be four or five dollars at like the Disney store. I have nothing against the Disney store. I go in there very often, <laughs> but if you can get it at the Dollar Tree, why not? They're little kids anyway like they're not going to be using this for anything really serious but i thought that this was actually really cute um of course they can continue to use the pencils and the little notepads in here i just thought it was really adorable and i was very excited when i saw these the next things that i got for them are these little mickey mouse candy canes um 
kids don't always love the taste of regular candy canes so these are actually cherry flavored um i just came to find out though that they actually do enjoy regular candy canes so that's good to know but um these are really cute and i love these um like i said again if you were to find these somewhere else the fact that they have mickey mouse on them would definitely just raise the price up so much so to be able to find this at the dollar tree is such a blessing and i love them I, it's so cute even like the little candy cane itself has mickey on it and i just really enjoy this i think that these are adorable and i'm kind of tempted to buy one for my own stocking <laughs> And then the next two things um, that I got for the kids are these. So I got one of them, this little Mickey Mouse journal. Um, I think I'm going to give this to the older nephew. And then I also got the, this um, Mickey Mouse jump rope. So these are just two more extra little things that are really cute stocking stuffers. And if you can find things that they are going to use, why not? And for a dollar, you just, you can't beat it. You can't beat it. I love it. I'm so excited about these. When I saw the amount of Disney stuff that they had at the Dollar Tree, I was so excited and I knew I had to get it. So I think most of the next few things are for um, Chandler's advent calendar aka things you can use for stocking stuffers for men um, or really I think most of this is for anyone but um, I got him a pair of these gloves. Now he doesn't ever wear gloves and I thought that I could spend like I was actually thinking about getting him a really nice pair of gloves like as one of his Christmas presents like a good expensive pair that would last him a very long time but he truthfully does not wear gloves um, ever so I thought just get like getting him a little pair from the Dollar Tree would be fine um, as part of his advent calendar because if we do want to go outside and like build a snowman or something at least he has them to throw on but he doesn't care about gloves that much he really rarely even wears like a winter jacket so I didn't think that it would be the best idea to buy him like a good pair of gloves until I feel like he'll actually wear them um so i thought that these were really good for now i also got this little um wall outlet this is called a wall tap i think it says um and you plug it into like a normal outlet and it gives you like the extra um space which is really convenient um if you don't want to have like a big bulky extension cord running around through your house this is really great because it does give you that extra space that you need and it's just convenient and for a dollar I mean why not I also got Chandler one of these little light up LED necklaces they are just like little Christmas bulbs and it does light up this is gonna be one of his things for his advent calendar of course he's never really gonna wear it maybe to work or something if they do like a dress-up day but I thought that this was cute and I mean it's very Christmassy I had to get some Christmassy type stuff <laughs> I also got him this like it looks more pink now but like it kind of I can't tell if it looks pink or orange in the camera. It looks a little bit more like corally orange in person, um, but it's just a pen and it has like those four different colors. It's like one of those like you can click whatever color. So it has red, blue, black, and green. And um, it is a stylus pen, which I thought was really nice. So it has like the stylus on top there and you can obviously use that for your phone, for your iPad. We do have like two or three iPads here. Um, and even if you don't use it for the actual pen because Dollar Tree's pens probably don't work at that great or if they do they probably don't last very long um, but the stylus is nice and I think it's really cool to have a stylus around um, especially sometimes like if you're out or something and you have gloves on and you don't have like those touch gloves um, having a stylus like in your bag is really nice to use for your phone or whatever so um, yeah I enjoy this and this could obviously this is for Chandler's having calendar but this could obviously be a really nice stocking stuffer for anyone in the family so these last few things and yes we are rounding it out here um i got these smarties um candy canes and these are going to be for the kids like for the nephews as well as for chandler's advent calendar um i'm gonna get some regular like peppermint candy canes as well but i just wanted to pick up the smarty ones i thought they were fun they're colorful they taste good so went ahead and got a pack of these you can't go wrong with candy canes obviously and you might as well get them at the dollar tree because they're a dollar i also got these frozen um like fruit snacks um so i think i'm just gonna throw these into some of my little cousins um gifts they're cute and of course they're frozen and i'm definitely going to be stealing some because i love fruit snacks and i love frozen <laughs> The next thing is some candy. So Chandler's favorite candy is Twix. Well, that's what it used to be. I don't really know if it still is, but I just continue to go along with this because 
I mean, that's what I always thought it was, and he's really not very picky, so I know he'll eat it regardless. And um, I just got him a pack of these, so I'm gonna throw like a couple of these in some of the days on his advent calendar, but candy is always a great stocking stuffer. He's definitely gonna be getting some more candy in his stocking as well, but I thought that this would be great to add some you know, extra stuff into his advent calendar. Um, next I got these car fresheners. I don't know how long these are really going to last or how great smelling these are really going to be, but I went ahead and got him this one. It's midnight cool. Um, it's just like silver with like black inside. This will be good. And even if it lasts a couple days, so what at least it kind of refreshes your car up. And I actually got this one for myself. This is just the vanilla flavor, but these are really great stocking stuffers because you can't go wrong with air fresheners. Honestly, I mean, like you need to make your car smell good, if you, especially for anything like me who always has food in my car. It always has like this weird food smell. So uh, car air fresheners are a really great stocking stuffer. It's really cute. And also this could be a really good like part of a gift that you want to build up. They actually sell a lot of really cute stuff at the Dollar Tree for your car. So you can get them like a steering wheel cover with the air fresheners. And then you can also get um, like, I don't know, like little tool things and just make it into like this little like manly gift. I don't know. I just think that that would be something cute to build up. Chandler's really not like a very hands-on like guy who likes tools and all of that um, but they actually did sell a lot of that stuff too which I did want to mention to you guys that would be uh, like really cute stocking stuffers for the man in your life if your dad or brother or whoever um, or even female hey but whoever in your life enjoys like tools and stuff they actually sell a lot of that but I just don't really have that person so um, I didn't pick any of that up <laughs> and then the last few things I got these um, tissues so this is a six pack of tissues these are Paw Patrol of course, Paw Patrol is very popular with the kids, and so um, the nephews are going to be getting some of these in their stocking, and Chandler's also going to be getting some in his advent calendar, because tissues are tissues, and no matter what the front of the packaging looks like, they're still tissues, they still get the job done. So, yes, a couple of these are going to be going to the nephews, as well as to Chandler's advent calendar. I also got some gum, of course. This is extra. This is the Polar Ice flavor. These are going to be for um, Chandler's advent calendar, and I might throw some of these in my mom's stocking as well. You can't go wrong with gum. I mean, everyone loves gum, and yeah, I just think that this is a really good stocking stuffer because everyone always wants gum, so it just makes sense. <laughs> and then the last thing that I got for Chandler's advent calendar, which of course could also be used as a stocking stuffer, um, is this Suave Men Active Sport Deodorant. So this actually smells really good. I did smell it. Um, and it has just like a typical guy scent to it, but this is the Suave brand, and Suave is a good brand, I mean, and it's like this little um, bottle, but it still is a really nice gift in my opinion, and for only a dollar, I mean, you really can't beat it, and you can't go wrong with having deodorant because you don't want to smell bad, at least I don't, I don't know... I don't know, but I don't want to smell bad, so, um, and I don't want my boyfriend to smell bad. So I thought that this was really nice, and again, this is a great stocking stuffer because you can't go wrong with getting people, like, hygiene stuff around Christmas time, even, like, getting toothbrushes, toothpaste, all, like, floss, all that kind of stuff. They're really, really great stocking stuffers because it's things that people use and need anyway, so why not help them out and put it in their stocking? So that was everything that I've picked up from the Dollar Tree so far, and yes, so far is the keywords there because there is still so much time left in the season, and I guarantee you that I will be making some more trips back. And if I get enough more stuff, then maybe I will go ahead and make another one of these videos, especially if you guys found it helpful. I do see myself going back quite a few more times and probably getting some more things. So if I do get enough, then I will go ahead and make another one of these videos. But that is what I've got thus far. It is only like what is today's date? I think it's November 14th. So we still have over a month until Christmas. And I'm very excited to see if the Dollar Tree like comes out with more stuff or if they restock anything because it did look like they had some other things, but um, they just haven't restocked yet. So they could be things that I want to pick up. You never know. But I will be going there and seeing what else I can find. I also really, really love building gifts up there like I mentioned with um, my boyfriend's mom that she's going to be getting those like oven the oven mitts and like the cookie mix and all that I really think that that is such a cute idea and also like the other little um 
like home gift that I'm building up with like the calendar and the pens and all that. I just love doing that because I think you can find so many like good quality things there and just build it up into this really cute thoughtful gift that if you were to get those other things separately elsewhere you would spend a small fortune for no reason when you can find just as good of quality at the Dollar Tree not all of the things is just as good of quality, but for the most part, and it is so much cheaper than what you would spend somewhere else. So I love doing that. And of course, all of the cute little kids stuff that they have for stocking stuffers and even for adults. I mean, all of the things that I showed you for Chandler and some of those things that I might go back and get for my mom as well for her stocking. So I mean, truthfully, I just think that they have such a good, like, just they just have so many options i just love it there so much and i can't say enough good things about the dollar tree so that is everything that i've gotten and i just love that they have all of these disney things there as well because like i said if you were to get disney stuff anywhere else it's just always so much more expensive just because it has disney on it so to be able to find all of those things for a dollar is just so great and I can't say enough good things about it. So yes, that is everything I've gotten and I will be sure to share with you guys if I do pick up anything else, which I probably will, let's be honest. And I really hope that this gave you guys some ideas on ways to build up gifts for people for the holidays, um, but also just stocking stuffers because I think that they have so many good stocking stuffer ideas there. And I really hope that I was able to help you out and give you guys some ideas. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I will be having some more holiday related content coming out soon so please be sure to be on the lookout for that I will have gift guides coming out and all other types of things so be on the lookout you guys won't want to miss it I thank you guys so much for watching this video I truly hope that you enjoyed and I will see you all in the next one bye